Thanksgiving may look different for many this year. Uh, certainly for many, it could be smaller family meals, but still there's going to be turkey, potatoes, and more. So where do our Thanksgiving foods grow? Good question. Heather Brown explains how Minnesota and Wisconsin helped to set the table. What's for dinner? Oh, we're going to have turkey. Oh, I got the celery for my stuffing. Potatoes. Yeah. Sweet potatoes. Pumpkin pie. Macaroni and cheese. Greens. <laughs> cranberry sauce. Pretty much the worst. You guys are making me hungry. <laughs> If you're having turkey this Thanksgiving, it's it's pretty big. There's a very good chance it was grown and processed here in Minnesota for years. We've ranked number one in turkeys. Cranberries, yay or nay? Oh yes, definitely. Yeah. Wisconsin is the largest producer of cranberries in the world. It grows up to 65% of the U.S. market, and the vast majority are juiced or canned. Fresh or the cans? The canned. None of them like the the texture of them. I've tried. <laughs> and speaking of Wisconsin, they're the largest producer of potatoes east of the Mississippi, second only to Idaho and Washington. Sweet potatoes are a different story. They're mostly from warmer climates in the southeast. Cub Foods in Minnesota gets theirs from Mississippi this time of year. Is it Thanksgiving without a pumpkin pie? No. Yeah. <laughs> and I love a uh, cool whip on it with the <laughs> yeah. that is so good. And if you're a pumpkin pie lover, be thankful for the area around Peoria, Illinois. It ranks number one by far in growing and producing the pumpkins we eat. What's Thanksgiving going to be like this year for you? A little different. Yeah. Very um, different. But you're still making the big meal. Yeah. Yes, I am. Uh, deliver them. <laughs> we're very lucky to be able to do this. Heather Brown. Yep, I, we're very lucky. We're blessed. <laughs> WCCO, we're, 4 we're, News. We're really blessed. When it comes to fresh green beans, Wisconsin leads the market. Sweet corn is mostly canned this time of year, and Minnesota is number two behind Washington State.